Hello everyone and welcome. Uh, I have in front of me an order that I just got in from RitualMotion.com. You may remember that uh, about a week ago, a couple weeks ago, I published a video of me and others from the Ritual Motion community playing Among Us. It should be up in the title card thereabouts over there. If it didn't come up, make sure you yell at me because it means that I missed the other title card in this video too. Um, after that and seeing um, Hero19X's really cool t-shirt and just some other stuff, I was like, I need to get more than just my Warrior Gaming skins. So I placed an order and I'm excited to open this up. Uh, so yeah, let's see what we got. I know what I got, but let's, let's see how it is. I'm Boater. Let's unbox something. Before I dig in here, uh, I'll go over what we what what Ritual Motion is. I have previously made a video touting the Warrior Gaming skins. Again, that is the second I card that is either there or that I have missed. So make sure you yell at me if it's not there. Um, and they have a lot of benefits. I talked about it in that video. I did not mention the compression benefit that helps with blood flow. So that is another thing there. Ritual Motion as a company is focused on gaming wellness, gamer wellness. Um, and they publish a lot of blog posts about um, staying fit, uh, ways to reconcile a gamer lifestyle with, um, with keeping yourself physically healthy and mentally healthy. Um, there's a lot of great stuff there, so make sure that you check that out at RitualMotion.com, uh, the blog, and there's some products too, so let's check these out. Um, which to do first? Eeny, meeny, money, mo. Let's open some clothes without knocking over my hot chocolate. So, um, at the moment, as I record this, there is, um, a lead time of a couple weeks on apparel. Uh, so be conscious of that when you order because of these uncertain times. Um, yeah, there's a bit of a backup because it's cool stuff and a lot of people want cool stuff. Just be aware of that. It's fine. Um, we have a couple things here. The first is a Ritual Motion t-shirt right there. I, a fool, Got that in a plus one size, not realizing that this is a, uh, what's, what's the exact blend of fabric on here? It's, it's, it's like a workout shirt. Um, and I do not see exactly what the fabric blend is, but it, it, at first I thought it would be like a cotton shirt. It is not. It is, uh, it is a hundred percent polyester. So this shouldn't shrink in as much in the wash as I had expected. So this is probably, this is going to be a big comfy one for me to wear. Um, but probably not one that you need to get in plus one size. Um, they are available on the site both with the text and logo like that or just with the circular logo on the center there. But that's cool. That's like great quality. I'm already wearing a t-shirt, so I'm not going to put it on right now. Um, but yeah, that is the t-shirt. I know that it's out of frame over there. Hold on. Maybe if I just kind of poof it up a little. Yeah, that's sort of thing. You can go on the box, even though I'm going to be opening the box in a second. Also in this bag uh, that came with the apparel is a jacket. The, uh, I believe they called it, yeah, Augusta Sportwear jacket. This comes in both men's and women's styles, and that is really cool. Um, again, the, the fabric is uh, let me see here. Fabric on the jacket is also polyester. It feels very similar to the uh, t-shirt. I'm going to put it on and judge whether it's a uh, cool weather jacket, uh, a cold weather jacket, or a uh, slightly brisk. I don't know. I'm going to assign a season to this jacket right now. If I can get the, get the zipper open. There we go. Okay, this is definitely... Well, it's a very light material, but it also feels somewhat well insulated. Um, I like it. I feel cool in it. Zipper, do you work better the second time around? Yeah, you do. Yeah, that feels good. Oh, I could, it feels light, but because of the fabric that it is, I could easily see myself warming up a lot in it. That, um, yeah, that's, 
I'm going to call this a mid-fall jacket, a mid-autumn jacket. Um, keeping in mind that I, that I live upstate New York, so both the climate around here and also my tolerance for it. <laughs> um, late autumn, you're going to definitely want something heavier. Um, early autumn, like, you'd... You could wear this like in the morning. Um, today was a like maybe 65 degree day. I could see wearing this in the morning and then I'd just go without after that. Um, but yeah, I like it. Um, the sleeves feel a little, no, I'm just wearing it lopsided. It's not on my shoulders correctly. Oh no, that's fine. Yeah, no, that's good. Like it felt a little odd putting it on at first around the shoulders, but you know, hold on, let me, you know, not be sitting with it the entire time. I'm gonna get up, get up. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna get up, walk around a little. Sleeves are maybe a little short. Let me see what size I got this in. Okay, I did not plus one size this one like I did with the shirt. Um, I would say the jacket is the right size. The sleeves feel maybe a little short, but I also have kind of long arms. So, I mean, it's not bad at all. I reach and you can kind of, they come down a little bit, but otherwise, we're good. We're good. Yeah, that is um, the shirt and jacket from uh, Ritual Motion. Um, fulfilled through Squad Locker, which sent a uh, little card with care instructions for, um, you know, turn the garment inside out, wash on gentle cycle, minimal detergent, tumble dry cool, or hang dry. Um, and a little sticker? Yeah, a little sticker of like a little octopus dude. I don't know. Cool. That's that. Okay, what's in the box? Shirt can go over here now. Make sure we show the stuff. In the box, I decided to try out um, what is referred to as snack, um, which is a healthier alternative gamer snack, uh, or at least so Ritual Motion says. Um, there are four flavors of snack. Um, in, in general, snack is a high protein, um, you know, it's instead of grabbing chips or something, um, you grab this, it is high protein, it is uh, spirulina which I'm 90% uh, sure I am pronouncing correctly. A superfood um, sweetened with uh, natural sugar, dry fruits. Um, I looked into spirulina a little bit and sometimes it's used as like a dietary supplement, which I see mixed things about doing that. Maybe I am not a dietitian. Take no advice from what I say. Uh, but that said, as like something, it's a healthy alternative to corn chips or potato chips. Yeah, let's look at these. So there are four flavors and I got a bundle to try one of each uh, and they are split up into two different focuses I guess um, there are two uh, that are meant to energize and focus this is blueberry and matcha 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 and the second is apricot and matcha words that I'm not familiar with because me just not a familiar I'm not familiar with healthy stuff Meh. Um, the blueberry matcha uh, lists off uh, the three main ingredients as blueberries high in free radical fighting antioxidants uh, flax seeds uh, high in dietary fiber uh, and omega-3 fatty acids and matcha a slow release naturally derived caffeine so not an immediate burst of energy like a big sugar rush that then leaves you with a crash afterward and then spirulina, the superest of all superfoods. It's green and clean. Spirulina is teeming with antioxidants, brimming with beta carotene, rich in iron, calcium, and plant-based protein. So, uh, energize and focus, we've got blueberry, and we've got apricot. And then the other focus is relax and recover. Um, this one is apple and tart cherry. Uh, and this one is the one that I'm probably the most excited to try out. It is banana and cinnamon. Um, apple and tart cherry. Um, apples contain pectin, a kind of fiber that acts as a prebiotic. Tart cherries are a great source of natural melatonin, which supports sleep. Cinnamon is an anti-inflammatory that supports gut and heart health. Um, it, 
and then spirulina as the base. Uh, bananas are a source of vitamin B6, which helps boost serotonin levels. Cinnamon, and again, an anti-inflammatory that supports heart health, gut and heart health. And then, ooh, raisins in this one too. Help glycogen production, which aids in muscle recovery. Um, so yeah, uh, the idea is as you're going into a gaming session, maybe, have a couple of the Energize and Focus, um, specially formulated to deliver long-lasting energy and enhance focus when you need it most. And then at the end, just so that you don't crash, uh, our Relax and Recover blends combine high-protein spirulina with superfood ingredients that promote relaxation and recovery for your mind and body. I'm going to have one of each. I have no idea how they are. I am frankly a little nervous that I'm not going to like the taste of any of them. I don't know. I've never had spirulina anything before. But we're going to try this out. Uh, and we're going to go uh, left to right uh, for you guys. So uh, first with the Energize and Focus Blueberry and Matcha. I cannot open it because the tear was above where it would need to be in order to actually open the pack. I should have had scissors. Oh, there we go. I'm just defunct. Okay. Yeah. Definite blueberry. Like, that's the main taste, is blueberry. Like, huh. Who would have thought? I was worried that there would be, like, a base that I didn't like that then had a little bit of blueberry flavor in it. No, I really like that. That's great. Um, they're like the, they're these little, um, the word coming to mind is chunk, which does not, uh, which is not an appetizing term. Uh, little clusters, clusters of, of food stuff. There are four servings for each of these containers. So I am not going to overdo it. I had a couple of those. I like the blueberry. Blueberry. Blueberry gets a pass. All right, this one appears to have the tear and everything in the correct spot. So this should be easier to open. This is the apricot and almond. Oh, that's a big chungus. Let's get a little less than that. The texture feels like raisins. I was going to say dried raisins, but, raisin, but raisins are by their very nature dried. So. That's a more neutral taste. I, I rarely ever have apricots, so I can't say, I don't know. Is that apricot taste? If so, apricot doesn't have a strong taste. I feel like apricot should have a stronger taste than that. Not bad. Not a go-to for me. Um, out of the two, out of the two energize and focus blends, I definitely prefer the blueberry, but not bad. Now let's go with the apple and tart cherry, which I also think I'll enjoy, uh, especially after like I was nervous going in because I was worried about the spirulina base, but it's basically it's tasteless almost, and kind of lets the other flavors come through. Apple and tart cherry. Doesn't really taste like anything. Doesn't really taste like apples. Doesn't taste like apple jacks, which doesn't taste like apples. Not sure as a texture. Maybe that's a little bit cherry, but like, I'm searching for it. It's not a bad taste. But it's not setting me off for like, yummy, yummy, yummy either. Last one, banana and cinnamon. Gotta have high, high hopes here. Boy, if I knew any of the lyrics, I absolutely would have broke out in the song on that. Panic of the Disco fans should be very happy that I didn't. Uh, okay. Big chunk. Banana and cinnamon of the Relax and Recover. Mmm. 
Definitely banana taste in there. Other than that, like I don't really taste raisins. I don't really taste cinnamon. It's not an overpowering cinnamon taste in either of these that have cinnamon in it. I mean, if you weren't as big a fan of Fireball as I am, you probably would taste the cinnamon. But I've apparently destroyed my cinnamon sensing taste buds. Maybe shouldn't have admitted that while talking about healthy foods. Anyway, yes. Um, so blueberry, yes. Banana, yes. I actually think that the blueberry one is probably my favorite. It has the strongest of those fruit tastes um, that they all uh, claim to have. Yeah, um, but all of them I really enjoyed. Well, I, I really enjoyed blueberry and banana, and I didn't hate apricot and apple. So yeah, that is, those are, those are snack, snacks, um, which are, again, a spirulina-based snack food. Um, and Again, while spirulina, you can, smarter people than me can debate all day about its use as a dietary supplement. Um, as a snack food, undoubtedly going to be healthier than corn chips or, you know, grabbing the Fritos, grabbing the Doritos. Um, popcorn is pretty neutral, but once you butter it up or throw a bunch of caramel on it, that's not going to be as good um, as, as healthy. Um, yeah, like it, these aren't as savory necessarily as you might get with some of those snack foods. So, you know, they're not going to be a straight replacement for them. If the taste, if the sensation is exactly what you're looking for, but they are so much healthier. And again, for, for my tastes, blueberries, blueberry flaxseed matcha, this one, probably the best tasting, the one that let that fruit flavor come through the most. Um, with the second place for me being banana, uh, banana and cinnamon, which I expected to be number one, but just the taste wasn't quite strong enough for me. Um, and these I don't hate, so I'm sure I'll go through them. Um, yeah, so this has been uh, my haul from Ritual Motion. Uh, I, I was really excited to get these and to try them out, and I can recommend them. At least I can recommend blueberry and banana. Sorry, I just thought that I, I've never had blueberry and banana together in a single thing. Like a smoothie or anything like that. And I feel like they're tastes that would go really well together. And now I'm sorry that I'm wasting your time, but this needs to happen. Come here. A little bit over here. Okay. A little bit over here. A little bit. Nope, that's a bigger bit. Okay. Huh? Mmm. Okay. I'm gonna stop stuffing my face now. I would be far too tempted otherwise. Yes. This is what I got from RitualMotion.com. T-shirt that I probably shouldn't have gotten plus one size, but it's gonna be very comfortable. Jacket that I cannot wait to wear. I feel all cool and stylish in it. Um, and again, it's a nice... This time of year, it's a good like morning jacket and then, um, you know, just not wearing it for the rest of the day. Uh, and the snack superfood, um, you know, snacks, <laughs> um, replacements for grabbing the most unhealthy stuff that you do during gaming. Um, a lot of great stuff. If you are interested in perusing the Ritual Motion shop on your own, then you can use the referral link that is in the video description or I probably put on screen right now. Um, or you can use code BOTER at checkout. That's B-O-T-E-R for 10% off. If you use the referral link, it should autofill the coupon for you. If it doesn't, just type it in manually. That's B-O-T-E-R at ritualmotion.com slash shop. Uh, it is a referral link. I do get a bit of a kickback on it, um, full disclosure, but it's 10% off. So go for it. Um, it's great stuff. And um, you can, of course, also get a set of your own Warrior gaming skins, either the Warrior 1 that does not have the wrist support but still has the compression and the cloth for uh, gripping and, 
you know, wicking away sweat and all that. And the Warrior 2, which adds wrist support for, um, you know, avoiding uh, worse medical problems that happen with the wrist with long sessions of gaming. So thank you all so much for watching. Uh, I hope that you check out the shop and find something really cool for yourself. Keep in mind that there are shipping delays currently on some things, but that's fine because it's it was worth waiting for. So thank you for watching. Have a good one, and I will see you next time. Bye, everybody!